Good afternoon. I'm Congresswoman Jackie Speer. As a co-chair of the Bipartisan Congressional Whistleblower Protection Caucus, I am deeply committed to working with my colleagues across the aisle to stop whistleblower retaliation. Because without whistleblowers, Congress and the U.S. government is severely disadvantaged when it comes to detecting waste, fraud, and abuse. I've worked diligently during my time in Congress to advocate on behalf of whistleblowers. I know that their bravery must be celebrated instead of penalized by those who would maintain a corrupt status quo. That's why earlier this year I introduced House Resolution 240, recognizing today as National Whistleblower Appreciation Day. And this year we are celebrating 241 years of protection for whistleblowers. Our founders saw protection of whistleblowers as so important to the cultivation of our democracy that legislation was passed even as we were still fighting for our independence. Whistleblowers remain just as vital today for the benefit of our democracy and our ability to uphold the rule of law. That includes the people honored with the Special Counsel Public Servants of the Year Award. People like F. Michael Abreu, Heather Callahan Chuck, and Charlene Matta, who blew the whistle in 2014 on lax airport security controls dismissed by TSA. TSA wrongly blamed Ms. Matta and Ms. Chuck for poor leadership. And when Mr. Abreu refused to give untrue information about his colleagues, TSA unfairly concluded that he was aligned with them. And less than two weeks later, all three were punitively reassigned. They put themselves at great personal risk and put their careers on the line for our safety. So thank you to them, to all of you here today, and to the unsung whistleblowers who have the courage and conviction to do what is right, even when it's easier to do nothing at all.